Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Nino Sport, man. This is Leicester City episode number four. Thank you so much for the support. Without wasting any time, let's look at the um, match preview, episode four preview. In short, Liverpool away, Andy at home. Um, reasonable game. We can win that one easily, and I'm gonna simulate it. Uh, Southampton away it's not a difficult game it's gonna be an easy game for us we should win that one trust the palace away it's another winnable game these are the teams that we should beat if we want to be in the Europa League at least without wasting any time enjoy the first game Liverpool at Enfield ladies and gentlemen welcome back man this is the first game of the episode we're going to anfield it's not gonna be an easy game it's gonna be a tough game as i mentioned on my review let's look at the starting lineup it's back over the atal madison chairman's daddy so you're to evans pereira and chilwell on wing backs we're not changing our starting lineup too much except for Perez and Atal, they do change events and IJ do change. I did mention that in the start of the season. Mani, Salah and Minamino up front. I don't know what happened to Firmino. Why is he not playing? Then Mikafield is the same three. Fabino, Henderson and Wanyan. Then Van Dijk and Skriniar. Skriniar is going to be a problem at the back. Because now their defense is way too strong. And we're going to struggle with that as well. Robinson and Alexander Arnold on the wing backs. They need to be closely watched by my wing, my right wing and left wing. We underway. Liverpool. First, first chance came to Liverpool on the 8th minute. It's with Jordan Anderson. The captain of course gave it to Fabinho. Find Salah. Mo Salah did finish. Technically, so it's one nil after nine minutes in the game. Then we are one nil down. Twenty-five minutes in the game, we did try to get something in the game. Madison got a chance. Madison took a shot, but Allison with a brilliant save. It was not much entertaining in the first half, but we did get a second chance. However, in the last minute of the game, where Madison took a shot, but Allison again stays strong in goals. We started second half bright. Barco got a chance, cut inside. Barco dribbled the, the defense and then passed the ball inside, but Tillemans missed. Allison again, but they came forward on the 63rd minutes. Mo Salah with his second of the game, he finished the game off there. Unfortunately, we are tunneled down, and I don't think there's anything we can do. On the 68th minute, they came back forward again. Another cross coming in, terrible defending there. I don't know what was that. But we managed to get away with it. On the 70th minute, they come back again. Same attack. Mo Salah finish it off. It is 3-0. We're not coming back in this one. 10 minutes left on the clock. One yell them. He saw Mane. Mane took a shot. Mane hit the post, man. And it comes out. The referee said it's not a goal. It didn't cross the line. But it's still with Robinson who took a shot. But there was a team effort of which it was easily saved by the keeper. Atal came forward. Five minutes left in the game. Gave it to Madison. Madison took a shot. Again, Addison denied Madison. It's the third time he denied Madison. Van Dijk tried a shot at the wrong time. Last minute of the game. He tries the header. It didn't work. It's the end of the game. Most other the men of the match. Let's simulate Bendy and see how we do on that one. It's a 2-2 draw. I know when I simulate a game against Bendy, I don't win it most of the time. So I guess that's the confirmation there. It's 2-2. Next game, we're going to Southampton. Let's see what we can do in this game. First, we're going to have to... Look at our starting 11. It didn't change much. Perez is back in the starting 11. That's the only change in the game. So it's Paco Perez and Vardy up front. 
Ings and then that Chen guy. It's gonna be tough, man. Red man and Chen. Chen is fast. Ings is a goal. Is a poacher actually. Is a poacher. But Vestergaard is playing us. We used to like Vestergaard when he was playing in German. But first chance came to us. Six minute back. Dribble the left back and then the right back could get forward and then he's in the area. There was so many things happened there. But he managed to take a shot. But the goalkeeper saved it. We came back 10 minutes in the game, Vardy got a chance, he skipped past Vestergaard and he take a shot, he scored, Jimmy Vardy, it's a goal, signature celebration, it's a goal, it is 1-0, good start for us, look at how he just passed that defender, it's like Vestergaard was not even there. Came back again, Jimmy Vardy, it's still Vardy going but he lost the ball. Bendrak, who just lose it, gave it back to Madison, who gave it to Vardy, he scored, but he was offside. He didn't realize until now that he was offside, but... Okay. We will come back, linesman. That must have been a close offside. Oh my god, Sayonchu, so he failed to defend. Chen took a shot, but the goalkeeper make a save again. He's bailing us out most of the time. Vardy came back forward, last minute of the game, good cross, he finds Barco, Barco missed the target. Tries a header, but he missed the target. At her own time, we came back again, it's with Didi. Didi gave it to oh, ah, Jose Perez, man, what a goal, what a goal that was, and what a time to score that goal. It was a big goal, man. Pass from Didi. What is Didi doing there, anyway? He did well. Second half is underway. Free kick coming in. And we just passed the striker. Chen scored easy there. I thought he was offside. But look at the linesman. How is he walking there? He's busy walking slowly. I don't know. He's walking like a robot. And then did he gave it to Tillermans. 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 Dribble all the defense. But he failed to take a shot. But a cross coming in from Barco. No one was there. Straight to Didi. To Ayosa Perez. Ayosa Perez with the cross. Vardy with the header. A save made by McCarthy. It's with Romeo. Romeo take it wide. He gave it to Valerie. Val I like Valerie. He's a good defender. Evans defended that well though. And the referee said, that's that. It's the end of the game. 2-1 after 90 minutes. Next game of the episode, Crystal Palace. It's not gonna be easy, man. Looking at the starting 11, nothing changed. Same as the last time. Barco, Vardy, Perez up front. Madison in the camp position. Tillamans, Didi in the defending middle field. And then we have the back two as obvious. Uh, I don't know that Perig, but looking at this starting 11, it's a disturbing one. The formation especially. Last time I said, I wanted to say for me, oh my god! What a goal by Vardy. What a goal by Vardy. First attack, first attempt, it's a goal. Jamie Vardy with a brilliant header. Another ball, it finds Jamie Vardy. Jimmy Vardy, 15 minutes on the clock, 16 now, Ayose Perez with a shot, it was saved. Miliajovic, the ball out wide, it's coming inside now, it's with Maya, Maya dribbled my players, but so don't you, what a tackle. Baku, Baku dribbled past players, gave it to Didi, Didi, he passed it out wide to Ayose Perez, who took a shot and the ball came back to him, he had it. Like Sterling scored the goal. Yeah, that was the exact header that scored Sterling hat trick. But unfortunately for Ayosa, it didn't happen. Second half is underway. Tillemans. Tillemans find Vardy. Vardy might take a shot, he does, but Quinta with the save. McCarthy. McCarthy with the with a good cross, Miljajovic. Missed the target. Just gave it to goalkeeper. But Baco, Baco is coming forward. Baco with a good cross. Jimmy Vardy. Oh my God. Two brilliant goals by Jimmy Vardy. 
in one episode. Oh my God, this player is amazing. Nine goals in the Premier League so far. He's really doing well. Again, Barco, who have like a good game in this episode. He passed the ball straight to prayer to score from the bench to score again. Priyat is doing well. Two minutes left on the clock. Every added two minutes, but we come forward again with Atal. Atal tried a shot, but straight to the defender. It's the end of the game. It's 3 now. Ball position 50 50. Okay, we tried to keep it tight because I want to dominate ball position as well at some point. But sometimes I'm under pressure to score goals than to just dominate ball position. Looking at the league table so far, we are 8 now. Last episode, we ended it when we were on. We are on the 10th position, I think. Now we are on the 8th position. Okay, it's a little progress. But West Ham have a game in hand. So, yeah. It's not uh, that entertaining so far. We are struggling. We are still far from reaching the Europa League spot that we're looking for because this season I'm looking for Europa League next season I'll be looking for a uh, Champions League but that means I need to make some good signings to get there that would be the end of this episode but we're not gonna go we have to do some match reviews episode but i just hope that you guys enjoyed it uh, let's look at the match reviews now and see what happened in episode four liverpool away we lost three mid it was expected but i've scored one i think uh three mid is a bit embarrassing but then okay we managed to get that we went to bendy bendy came to us honestly it was a 2-2 draw. I was disappointed. It was a simulation, but I was disappointed. Always, I can't beat Bentley in the simulation. It's a draw. Uh, Southampton away, we managed to win 2-1. And then Crystal Palace away, 3-0 win. Good result towards the end of the episode. We did well. A slow start, but then we did well. Out of 12 points, we managed to get 7 points. It's not bad, but yeah, it's not enough. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like and then subscribe if you're new, guys. Thank you so much. Share it on your social media. Tell your friends to come join us here. It's fun, man. It's still gonna be nice. I'm even thinking of starting another career mode that will be re will be released on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Cause if you know very well, I don't release on those days. But uh, I might release. Um, four episodes in the row i took days off at work so i might release on saturday sunday and monday and tuesday as well then wednesday as normal we're gonna have our normal episode that will be released other than that thank you so much guys please leave a like please subscribe your boys out bye